KT News. Na kiongozi wa chama cha ODM Raila Odinga amekemea kile ambacho anasema ni matamshi machafu kutoka kwa baadhi ya viongozi na kusema kwamba kwa sasa taifa linataka utulivu na wala sio cheche na ndimi za uchochezi. Naye mbunge wa Suna East Junaid Mohamed na katibu mkuu wa Kotu Dr. Francis Atoli kwa upande wao wakimsuta naibu wa Rais William Ruto ambaye wanadai ndiye anayetoa muongozo kwa wafasi wake kueneza matusi na kisha anadai kuwakanya. kikao na viongozi kutoka Jimbo la Kajiado ameelezea kudhika kwake na baadhi ya viongozi wanaosheheni siasa za chuki This country deserves peace and unity now more than ever War cries and beating the drums of war will not work It is dishonest and old school for Ruto to send his people to insult other leaders including the president then pretend to be telling them to stop waachane na mama zetu lakini kama wanataka sana kupigana na mwanamke wakutane na mwanamke mwenye yako kwa siasa kama mimi hakuna haja ya kuongelelea vibaya mama yetu mheshimiwa na mama mwenye tunamheshimu na inchi yote mama ngina odinga kiwarai viongozi kuwajibika na kusitisha cheche za uchochezi i appeal to these leaders to stand for the united kenya and tell off those preaching war and issuing threats against fellow kenyans na tunataka kuambia yeye sasa ya kwamba asimamishe hiyo tabia chafu ambayo ameanza katika nchi yetu ya Kenya ya kutusi serikali ambayo yeye mwenyewe ni deputy president kama anaona ya kwamba ametosheka na hiyo serikali na ameshika vitu zake na imetosha kuwa rais ya Kenya atoke nje aende pambane nje kama vile sisi tuko nje huwezi kukunyia ile sahani ambayo unakulia katibu mkuu wa kotu Francis Atoli akidai ni naibu wa rais anayewaelekeza wafuasi wake kuchachisha siasa there is nobody who has refused William Samoe Ruto and his team to resign from the government if he is dissatisfied but he has vowed to remain in the system and wreck the boat while he's in that particular boat he has already come to the reality that he's not going to be the president because if you have people say as they have been claiming why should you tell your goons to attack uh, the first family to abuse the first family Bungeni kamati ya utawala na usalama wa taifa chini ya mwenyekiti wake Paul Koinange ikimtaka naibu wa rais kubeba msalaba wa wafasi wake. We want him to go beyond Twitter as also a leader in the nation to apologize in the manner that is appropriate to his excellency the president. It was a personal attack and an insult to not only the president but also members of of his family. Moso his mother Mkuu wa polisi Hilary Mutiambai akitoa onyokali kwa viongozi The National Police Service will leave no opportunity to any leader to any leader intending to incite the general public to violence such incitement shall be faced with the full force of the law Kwa upande wake naibu wa rais William Ruto amewaonya viongozi kutojihusisha na siasa za matusi. Duncan Haimba, KTN News. Na mtazamaji kufikia hapo tupate mapumziko mafupi mno na kisha turejee na taarifa zaidi salia papo hapo.